Okay, so the question is, how do you find boundaries? Well, let's look at it this way. If the data value is 15, you're going to want to go to the next place value and think of it as 15.0. Then you're going to want to add and subtract 5 in that place value. So you're subtracting 5 tenths. You're adding 5 tenths to 15.0. So that's going to become 14.5 and 15.5. So the question is, what happens with the number of 2.54? Well, once again, you go to the next place value and think of it as 2.540. Once you're there, then you add and subtract 5 in this place value. So that's in the thousands place value. So you're going to subtract 0 0.005, which is 5 thousandths, and you're going to add 0 0.005, 5 thousandths, and you're going to get 2.535, and you're going to get 2.545. So that's how you find boundaries for a given data value.